。中国大力王和美国猛男签下生死状，打赢比赛，奖励六千万，打死当场翻倍。好了，各位亲爱的观众朋友们，大家好，欢迎收看本场比赛。这场中国大力王龙武和美国猛男马特丹尼尔斯的精彩对局，啊，那本场比赛确实很精彩了。我们中国大力王呢，这个龙哥呀、啊，和美国大力士来上一场这个年前的生死对局。那两人之间啊，这个赛前签下了生死状啊，这个打赢对手呢，可以获得六千万。美金的奖励啊，但同时呢，如果你打死了对手啊，当场翻倍啊，变成一点二亿啊，那确实挺诱人，确实挺夸张。好，来看一下本局比赛，呃，左边选手是我们中国大力士，而右边选手是美国猛男啊，丹尼尔斯。那么对方丹尼尔斯赛前呃也是嚣张放话啊，表示我们中国大力士啊根本不是他的对手。啊，并且扬言啊，呃，我们中国人根本不会打拳啊，这个打中国人，他可以以一敌一百，一口气打倒一百个人。哦呦，对方的丹尼尔斯啊，这个态度上来看是很嚣张的。那么他的目的啊，就是想巩固自己在美国的人气以及地位啊，所以说也是不断的挑衅、辱骂我们中国人。啊，因为在美国的话，有一半的一大半人口啊，他对我们中国是充满了仇视啊，以及这个嫉妒。呃，所以说呢，这个辱骂、羞辱我们中国人呢，可以给对方的丹尼尔斯啊带来很大的、很高的一个人气啊。但是你觉得很正常，但是在我们中国人的眼中，你是触碰到了我们的底线。好，本局比赛来看一下我们中国大力王的表现啊！啊，咱们龙哥赛前也是放出了狠话，表示让要让对方的美国猛男过不去这个年啊，让他这个躺着滚回美国，还是很霸气的啊！好，这场比赛咱们龙哥很稳啊，连续的防守，稳中取胜啊，稳扎稳打。Nice. How's he gonna follow this one? He loaded up there on that high kick. Man, these guys are flowing back and forth. Oh! Oh! Lands a nice one too. Got to figure out a way to move those feet and ultimately circle out and get that head off the center line. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Yeah, he fixed it all up. Oh, big head kick lands. Akhmedov gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. Oh, another one lands flush. One head kick after the next tonight. Can someone tell me how his opponent is still standing? Oh, how many knees can one man take? Oh, there's the head kick. It's blocked. Lands the left punch now, followed by a right. Oh man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard. Every time you can see him drive his shin. Into his opponent. Oh, there he goes attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting them to slow down and fight at your pace. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, well-timed overhand there by Akmedo. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave 
where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Both fighters here. 哎呦！屏幕前的各位观众朋友们，比赛第一回合已经打完了。我们中国大力士大战一个美国猛男的对局。那么赛前的话，那么双方啊也是签下了生死状啊，并且呢打赢对手啊，奖励六千万。呃，打死对手的话是奖金当场翻倍，变成一点二亿啊。那本场比赛对于双方来讲呢都是有效的啊，对方打死咱们也同样能够拿到一点二个亿。所以说，本场比赛的话是一场这个一定是要发生血案、发生人命的一场对局。好，比赛来到了第二回合，让我们来看一下双方选手呢，第二回合会有怎样的一个精彩表现。好，那么中国大力士上来的摇闪很轻松，有着很壮的体型，但是身材啊还是很灵活的、啊。Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Big left hook coming. It's blocked. Look at the angle of that nice body. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, super. Is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Ahmed on lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Beautiful. He landed it perfectly. Perfect place. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Just unable to quite find that range. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Oh, big left hook there! A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Just over three minutes to go. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combination, oh! News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. All right, great position for him here. He's got the full mount. See if he can get that ground and pound going. Oh, he's got to get it going, but can't rush. A lot of times, guys get in the full mount and they rush. They get nervous. They're like, "Oh my goodness, I'm winning." The reality is, you're winning, but it can change in a matter of seconds because then they can be gone. He's got to drop his hips, be really heavy at the opponent's base, and then just start to work. Make the opponent give his back so that he can try to get his chokes off or find great ground and pound with very patient. Ground and pound from such a dominant position. Not there. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Notice the drive. Look at how they drive the knee right into the midsection. Real quick leg kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length, of course. It's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Beautiful kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, big head kick. Nice loop and punch. Hardy closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. 
just misses with the jab. Nice body. Oh, huge elbow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. into that leg kick. He is showing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeling jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. You got him whip his head. 哎呦，双方选手啊，各位观众朋友们，这场比赛打的是鲜血直流，太精彩了！而且我们中国大力士在比赛的第二回合过程当中啊，这个差一点点，就差一点点啊，就 KO 了对方美国猛男。好，看一看这个杂肘，哎呦，这个杂肘实在是太漂亮了，但是很可惜啊，那这个杂肘呢，仅差一点点啊，就 KO 了对手。好，本场比赛的话，即将要来到我们今天的第三回合了啊！让我们来看一下我们中国大力士在第三回合会有怎样的一个表现啊？能否 KO 对方的美国猛男丹尼尔斯，完成这场比赛的对局？好的啊，两个猛男的对拼，让我们来看一下第三回合啊！两个人打了十分钟之后，这个体能是否还充沛啊？就是考验双方的这个作战经验了啊！哎呦！对方美国猛男的正蹬腿。Oh! He's He's oh, he up there, gained some valuable separation, and now the ground and pound start. All right, he continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Back to his feet. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Whoa! Oh, yo! This kick is very beautiful. We are in the third round of the fight. The Chinese Dali Shi, the Dali Wang, the Long Guo, very strong. Strike to the head. Strike to the head. 千万啊！这个具体是踢死了还是说是啊踢晕了不清楚，但是我们至少可以拿到六千万啊，是个好消息啊！但是我们龙哥赛宴说了啊，六千万啊，一分不要，全部捐献给我，还是非常爱国的。咱们再次恭喜，好了，咱们下期视频再见。十六岁中国小伙拳法实在太恐怖，一拳打穿了美国巨人的肋骨，穿破肚皮，当场躺尸。好的，来看一下，首先登场的这一名选手，哎呦，这个长得很奇怪啊，尤其是这个胡子啊，可以发现的很有很有特点。这一名选手没有错，正是美国拳坛悍将帕德里克。彪悍的铁拳呢，可以摧毁任何一位敢站在他面前的选手。那不仅如此啊，他在世界拳击大赛当中啊，各大奖项更是拿到手软。呃，不过这个家伙的话确实很嚣张啊，在来中国比赛的路上嚣张狂言：“我们美国人才是世界第一，你们中国人啊，在我的眼里，你们连条狗你们都不算啊！你们中国人啊，就是一帮只会抱团取暖的胆小鬼。”哎呦，听到这里的话，确实很愤怒了啊！这个美国，美国的这么一个大胡子啊，敢胆敢对我们中国的如此的不尊敬啊，触碰了我们中国人的底线。那这一番言论也是惹恼了我们中国很多人啊，包括上百名中国拳师啊，其中呢就包括眼前这一位，我们来自于中国十六岁的小伙王小龙。那么在赛前，我们中方选手王小龙也是表态，本局比赛呢将会代表所有的中国民众，将对方的这个美国嚣张巨人帕德里克给他打到爬着滚出擂台啊！小伙还是非常有血性，本场比赛他也是很愤怒。好，比赛马上就开始了。那么据说这个国外媒体啊也正在直播这场比赛啊，有很多的老外啊也在观看这场对局。但是更多的老外呢，本局比赛是来看我们中国人的笑话来的啊！为什么看我们笑话呢？因为他们认为啊，我们中方选手王小龙本局比赛没有一丝一毫的可能战胜他们。哎呦，这个美国人啊，嚣张跋扈惯了，也猖狂惯了，认为任何人都不是美国人的对手。但是我今天就是要打你们的脸
，就是要告诉你们这帮美国佬呢，你们美国人在我们中国就是不行啊。好，本局比赛来看一下王小龙的表现啊。那本局比赛大战一个比自己身形壮上四五倍的这么一个美国巨人啊，确实不好打。让我们一起来看一下王小龙的表现，侧踢腿。小伙打法上还是比较迅猛的，比方帕特里克啊，一个身强力壮的美国重炮手。好，王小龙连续的反击，中扫腿。比方帕特里克很沉稳。那么双方今天的比赛是五回合的赛制啊，每回合五分钟的时间。那么举办的地点呢，也是在我们中国啊。好，来看一下王小龙的打法啊，小伙是从小练习中国功夫，所以说这个基本功呢是非常扎实的。Edge of your seat action as expected so far, and he landed the right hand there. Nice punch by Ahmed. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, and he got tagged by that combination. His coach said on Thursday to us, "It has to be punches and bunches. It has to be volume." And his student has certainly followed up on that imperative. So much volume, but the accuracy, the accuracy of this fighter is truly unbelievable. Out of range with that kick attempt, and he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Akhmedov. Punch coming, it's blocked. Beautiful body kick. How good is that right hand? Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well placed kick there by Akhmedov. Real quick leg kicks. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big head kick lands. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Good stick. Akhmedov's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Got the single collar tie. Right hand punch to the clinch. Akhmedov's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. Landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach, and certainly is making it count in this one. Right hand on point. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Well, it's one thing to have length; it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Akhmedov. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Misses with that punch. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Kick. If you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Big power punch land. Now he gets back in range. Akhmedov gets hit by that kick to the body. Well, he's got a pretty good side kick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's going. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo. 好的，来看一下比赛第一回合结束。
呃，那么这场对局啊，美国猛男帕德里克来中国撒野啊，并且大喊“美国第一，中国狗屁不算”。虽说也是惹怒了我们中国的十六岁格斗少年王小龙，小伙呢是非常讨厌美国佬的啊。虽说大多数的比赛啊都是在和美国人在擂台上厮杀，那么包括本场比赛的对局呢，也是大战一个美国巨人。好，这里王小龙稍作休息，比赛来到第二回合，让我们来看一下双方选手比赛第二回合的表现。好，第二回合开始，来看一下，哎呦，王小龙一上来是连续的点刺，对方帕德里克仗着自己人高马大，是率先发起了猛攻。Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Akmedov. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Nice kick landed there by Akmedo. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, two limits of the guard. Sight to behold. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Ooh, and he caught the kick. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Oh, nice right hand, John. Three minutes and change to go in round two. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. And both guys really throwing with authority. Outstanding kick there by Akmeda. Tags him with the uppercut. I don't know how many times he can get hit in the head and stay in this fight. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Nice strike. Big leg kick land. Got clip with the right hand. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You should never be a stationary target. So even if the feet aren't moving, you got to be ready to slip that head at a moment's notice. Straight punch lands. Lands flush with that right hand. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate. A lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. It's not over. It's not over. Keep that right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Akmeda. Able to check the high kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Nice kick there by Akmeda. Another leg kick land. Trying to double up on that jab. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Oh, what a punch. 
lands the right hand. Still nice body kick lands. Back and forth we go. Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. Ah. You are battering that nose. 好的，没有错，这里哨声再次吹响，两回合打完。哎呦，今天的比赛确实太精彩了。我们中国小将王小龙呢，他的拳法真是太恐怖了。小伙儿，呃，别看骨瘦如柴，年仅十六岁，但是他本局比赛所展现出来的这个不卑不亢的精神，英勇战斗到底的精神呢，确实值得我们去学习。啊，小伙子，本局比赛说句实话呀，想战胜对方的这个美国巨人帕德里克呢，的确啊是一件比较难打的比赛。那毕竟对方选手呢如此之壮，而我们这边的话是如此之瘦小。但是功夫高不高不在于人大小。好，比赛来到了今天的第三回合，让我们来看一下双方选手。一上来，王小龙是率先的把对方帕德里克逼到了龙边，双方的一波战力上的对拼。对方帕特里克连续前手点刺
Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Well, DC, no denying he's winning this fight, and it's got to feel pretty good if you're a fighter. You put in the work, and it all comes together on fight. When it all comes together, nothing feels better to go out there and implement the game plan that you guys have worked on in training camp, and it goes as desired, nothing feels better. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. That's a big strike right there. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Oh, nice technique to land that kick. body kick land right under the elbow. Oh, beautiful shot there with the hook. I'm not sure his opponent saw that one coming. His opponent is taking straight punch. He's hooking right around the guard to land and land efficiently. Great punch. Connects with the right.这场比赛我来分析的话这个王小龙想要赢这必须要啊这个 this is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Dig and kick. Akhmedov's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Knee the body. Good punch, Lance. So once again, he lands another punch and making use of his decided edge and reach in this matchup. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, nice. Oh, that straight punch knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really putting his opponent on notice. Akhmedov gets touched by that kick there. Lands with the right hand. Medov's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice punch there by Akhmedov. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. Big body kick. Well, if you're going to leave your body that wide open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, he lands the overhand counter up top there, DC. And again, we've talked a lot about the reach advantage. Certainly helped him get into striking range there. Straight right hand, no good. Under three minutes remain in round four. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Akhmedov. Throws the right hand there. Nice punch lands over the top. Big body kick lands. Now connects with the right. Good series of strikes for him there. Staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Medov gets hit with a kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Way to hide that leg kick. Just over two minutes to go. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for.
nice loop of punch. Back and forth we go. Hook to the head lands flush there by Ahmedo. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. It's such a fast leg kick. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Nice punch by Ahmed. One minute. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Nice kick. Akhmedov gets tattooed by that straight punch. And he lands another punch defensively. His opponent's got to do something to prevent further damage. But it comes in bunches. No matter what he tries to do, he's going to answer with more of those strikes. He just misses there with the left. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. Nice. Beautiful body kick. 15 seconds to go. Oh, it's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. 好的，没有错，本局比赛啊，那目前为止四回合已经打完了。我们中国瘦小伙十六岁的王小龙呢，和对方的美国巨人帕德里克大战四回合。那么赛前呢，对方帕德里克这个扬言啊，说我们中国人狗屁都不算。那今天这场比赛的话，我们中方选手十六岁小伙呀，是狠狠的打了他的脸。一个小孩把他打的是皮开肉绽，逼上绝路。那么接下来。我也不妨告诉各位观众朋友们啊，那么接下来将是我们十六岁中国小伙王小龙的一场视觉盛宴。各位观众朋友们，让我们继续观看。Nice punch, Lance. Oh, and he caught the kick. Liver kick. What a body kick. Lands the double jab. Big kick lands. He blocks the punch. Nice punch there. Lands with the knee to the bottom. Nice body kick. Well, DC headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Effective punch there by Ahmed. Real sneaky body kick. Just missed with the left there. Big right hook coming. It's blocked. Kick to the body by Ahmed. Nice job of hiding that head. Back and forth we go. Three minutes now to go in the fight. Medov gets caught with that punch. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big head kick lands. Oh, nice overhand left. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Pretty good right hand. Closes 
the distance, gets the single collar tie, and they separate. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, GC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Look at the turn in that kick. Plus right hand is true. Ooh, what a head kick. Good punch. Over and over, he's landed a big body kick. Good right hand. Well placed kick there by Akmeno. Beautiful right punch, follows it up with the left. 90 seconds to go in the fight. Effective strike there by Akmeno. Nice head kick. Punches well. Oh, that right hand is on point. Tags him with the left hand. Whoa! Oh, yo, 转身后摆，让我们恭喜王小龙。本局比赛，我的天哪！十六岁小伙王小龙呢，最终在比赛的第五回合，那么也是本局比赛的最后一回合啊！这个转身后摆腿，一脚爆头，终结了对方的美国巨人帕德里克啊！那这一脚的话，确实太牛了。好，本场比赛让我们再次恭喜王小龙啊，完成了一场不可能完成的战斗。也希望各位观众朋友们多多点赞，多多支持。好了，咱们下期视频再见。八十七岁刘家权第七十代掌门人出山，打的英国女拳王九窍流血，当场横尸擂台。好了，各位新的观众朋友们，欢迎收看本场比赛的中英女子拳击大战的现场。本场比赛的比赛规则呢，那是相当相当的开放。那无论你是中国的传统武术家，还是说你是世界的拳击高手啊，那都可以来到本场比赛。所以说，有人说呢，这场比赛是否这个比赛规则太过于残酷啊？那既分高低，也分生死，完全就是一场生死大赛。但是我想说啊，这个。比武就是这样，你弱，你只有挨打的份儿。好，来看一下本场比赛，让我们看一下左边选手是一个满头白发的老太太，没有错，这位选手来头不简单了啊！他身着一身黑衣啊，一代宗师的味道。他是我们中国刘家权第七十代的掌门人，八十七岁高龄的刘香兰。呃，他已经是把这个刘家拳法呢传承到了现在，他已经是第七十代的传人了啊。所以说已经有八十七岁的高龄，但是今天呢仍然是来迎战啊对方的英国女拳王。哦呦，漂亮！后手的摆拳啊，再接上这个短距离的正蹬腿，老大娘的打法确实非常漂亮。刘家拳法名不虚传。好，本场比赛介绍一下，右边选手这一位啊，是来自于今天的挑战者，英国女拳王，人送外号“子弹姐”的舍甫琴科。好，为何叫她子弹姐呢？因为我可以发现啊，她的腰间啊纹了一把手枪，据说她的拳法像子弹一般啊，威力十足，而且爆发力、速度通通都有。那曾经啊，张伟丽和她打过平手啊，所以说她的实力很强劲。好，但是对方的这个子弹姐舍甫琴科呢，赛前很是猖獗，在媒体面前呢，向我们中国武术界呀发起了挑战，呃，表示要自己挑战整个我们中国武术界，无论男女老少，谁要不服就来挑战他，而且还表态啊，称我们中华武术啊是中看不中用的绣花枕头啊，根本不是他的对手。好，这个家伙很狂啊！但是今天我们的刘香兰啊，刘大娘啊，也是打算用自己的刘家拳法啊，也是要狠狠的教育对方。好，老大娘一上来的话，这个拳速啊，的确是非常的快。好，这场比赛让我们一起看一下，我们中国老大娘刘香兰啊，面对这个英国女拳王，号称要挑战中国武术界的射甫琴科啊，本场比赛双方会有怎样的一个精彩的对局？
今天。好的，没有错，比赛第一回合已经结束了。那今天的这场对局，我们中国老大娘呢，这个把刘家拳法也是带给了全世界。呃，但是他的对手呢，实力也是非常的强劲啊。毕竟是作为这个英国的顶级拳王，号称是有子弹一般速度拳法的拳手啊。所以说，两人之间的这场对局呢，虽说是呃年龄跨度比较大，但是打的的确是非常的精彩。好，那么接下来让我们一起看一下双方呢在比赛的第二回合会有怎样的一个精彩的对局。
哎呦，这场比赛没有想到啊，两人打了这个整整十分钟，还没能够结束本场比赛啊，的确确实是令我们感到惊叹啊。我们中国老大娘呢，刘香兰啊，八十七岁高龄，在擂台当中啊，把对方英国拳王揍的是鼻青脸肿。那对方选手呢，作为这个英国现在啊实力最强悍的一位。呃，可以说整个英国没有人比他实力更强了。但是今天面对我们中国的传统武术家，哎呦，你可以看到他真的是很狼狈啊。好，比赛第三回合，让我们一起来看一下。
哎呦 ，Ladies and Gentlemen， 本场比赛，我的天哪，整整大战十五分钟，这场八十七岁对战二十七岁的对局呢还没结束。那究竟是我们中国大娘太强呢，还是对方美国选手太弱呢？这不好说。但是我们唯一可以确定的就是，对方的确是没有这个能力能够 KO 我们。好，那各位观众朋友们，那相信您看到本场比赛也是非常兴奋，是吧？因为对方的美国啊，英国最强拳王，那今天在我们中国擂台呢，被一个老大娘啊打得如此之惨啊，这说明了我们中华武术啊，果然还是厉害。好，那么接下来看一下双方第四回合的精彩对局。
，哎呦，漂亮！这一脚下去，我的天哪！刘香兰、刘大娘直接踹翻了对方的英国女拳王，太漂亮，太精彩了！好，本场比赛让我们恭喜我们中国老大娘刘香兰，那同时也非常感谢各位观众朋友们的收看与支持。好了，咱们下期视频再见。